Tony D and Little Joan, and this is a screenwriter's rant on Don't Turn Out the Lights, another scary movie where teenagers get brutally murdered. Smash like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Check out my books. Links in the description. Comedy Hire in South Jersey. It's the Pineys, books 1 through 15, available at Amazon.com. Don't forget, Kindle Unlimited is free. Race to Witch Mountain. Uh, guys worked on this. The producer of Anaconda. Not the greatest credits in the world, but long story short, a group of hot young college age people end up in a RV in the middle of nowhere and they I don't know, some of the locals try to kill them? I, I'm not sure why. I think they get trapped on the road after getting run off by a truck and then one by one they're brutally murdered, I guess? Here's a guy covered in blood, like everybody's covered in blood and screaming, don't turn on the lights. Uh, let's see, who, who made this thing? Written and directed by Andy Fickman. Uh, it's a, hey, Fickman, you got your movie ready? I'm working on it. That's that's who I imagine Andy sounds like. <laughs> I'm working on it. What's it called, Andy? Don't turn off the lights? That sounds stupid. Uh, I'm just teasing. Um, first act. I mean, geez, do I even need to go over it? First act, they go out to a party in their crazy RV. Then they're run off the road or attacked or something. And then they're stuck. And then, I don't know, they, I guess they a bunch of hillbillies hunt them one by one. I'm not sure who the villain is here. There's a guy here creeping up, touching her fingers, screwing with her. I'm not sure what the deal is, but one by one, they're horribly murdered because they're trapped in the RV and they can't get back, I, I guess. And of course, you know, no signal. So there's that. Brilliant. And then in the end, they all die except like, I don't know, two of them somehow figure out how to fix the RV and go home. I don't know. It seems pretty by the numbers. Let's see if there's a write-up on the IMDb. Don't turn out the lights. This was from last year it was shot. A group of friends embark on a road trip to a musical festival, oblivious to the supernatural horrors, oh, they're supernatural, that await them along the way. Andy Fickman, writing and directing. Okay, and probably could have included what the hell the supernatural entities are. Are they vampires? Are they werewolves? Are they ghosts? Like, I mean... Why not show one of them? You know? It's like nothing here. It's just a... Or is it a bait and switch kind of thing where there's nothing there and they just accidentally all killed each other? Like, what? I don't get what the supernatural thing is. Is it a new one? Is it made up? I mean, give us a little data here. But sure, I... Would I see it? No, I'm not going to see this thing. I mean, maybe on streaming, if, I don't know, somebody put it on, you want to watch this? Oh, is there anything else on? No? Okay, I guess. I got 90 minutes to kill for some reason, but that, that's a pretty low bar. It would have to, it'd have to be that kind of situation. <laughs> is there any other movie on? No, all the other movies have been mysteriously erased today. Ah, well, I guess we're stuck with this. Like, that's the only way I would see this thing. Otherwise, it just looks like your basic hack and slash film. Um, you really ought to have included one shot of a monster, or in, or told us in a line what it was. Ah, we're being killed by vampires, like something, something. Give us something in a trailer. I mean, other than people screaming and covered in blood, like, is that that's supposed to be enough for me to see this thing? Well, they're covered in blood. It must be scary, like. Give us something. Anyhow, that's it for me, Tony D and Little Joan. Check us out on all our various links. You know the links over on the, the green one, the orange one, and the black one. Uh, it's where I post the other two videos you don't see here. Uh, coming up tomorrow, I will be in Strathmere at the Shivo Library in Strathmere, New Jersey at 6 p.m. for my talk on how to hunt the Jersey Devil. Then on Friday, I'll be at the River Road Clam House 
yeah, seafood place from 10 to 6 uh, up on the porch there, hanging out, telling piney stories, and hopefully having some shrimp. Uh, come on out. Hope to see you there. We'll see you.